huge social security update. Take a look at this. With Trump's social security proposal, you could get up to $1,500 to $4,000 a year, possibly. So money saved is money earned up to $4,000 a year. What would that mean for your financial life? Also, we're going to go over this article right here. Six ways Trump could change your retirement from social security to Medicare. And we saw that Bernie Sanders praises Trump on a certain idea, but Bernie Sanders agrees with Trump again. And Trump told the Republicans, hey, you're crazy. You can't cut Social Security and Medicare. And I think they're going to listen to him. I'm going to play the full video clip of that. I'm also going to give you some other important updates as well. Before I dive into the main content, if you appreciate these social security updates, hit the like button and subscribe to the channel for more social security updates. So lawmakers vow to strong resistance if Musk agency recommends social security or Medicare cuts. So this is coming from a Democrat from California here uh, talking about a potential social security Medicare cut from the Doge Department of government efficiency led by Elon Musk and Vivek Ramaswamy. Uh, what could actually happen here? Let's take a listen to this video clip right here. Government efficiency uh, led by Vivek Ramaswamy and Elon Musk. You, you come from uh, Silicon Valley. You represent that part of the country. What are your thoughts on this? I mean, should this be taken seriously? Should uh, two people from outside of government like Elon Musk and Vivek Ramaswamy have that kind of sway over what, you know, what stays and what goes in the federal government? they find areas of truly wasteful spending across the government, they would get support. But if they start to recommend cuts in Social Security or Medicare or Title I education funding, they'll face strong resistance. So it really just depends what they recommend. There's a lot of what ifs going on. What are your thoughts on that? I highly doubt that Trump would be okay with Social Security being cut, at least benefits. Now, I could see the Social Security Administration having a lot of cuts, becoming a lot more efficient with their government system bureaucracy. But when it comes to Social Security benefits, I highly doubt that that'll be cut, especially under Trump's watch. Uh, if anything, you're probably going to get more money from Social Security, which I'll get into a little bit later on. Go over the six different ways that uh, Trump's proposals could help out your retirement. So uh, time is running out for Senate to pass Social Security Fairness Act. This was the bill that was passed in the House. What is the latest with this? Uh, let's scroll down to what's going on. So what happens next? The bill has 63 sponsors in the Senate which is important because you need 60 votes for it to pass. Now, time is running out. You, there's only a few weeks left before the end of 2024. Once 2025 hits, there is no more vote, or the Senate can't vote on this Social Security bill. It would have to actually be voted again in the House. So the clock is ticking. Supposedly, there's sponsors. Supposedly, they're going to force a vote and have it happen. But we're not seeing any traction with that. just want to let you know what was going on with that. And now let's get to uh, <clears throat> this. Uh, Donald Trump gets unexpected praise from Bernie Sanders. Good idea. So this is referring to where Donald Trump wants to cut the credit card interest rates down to 10% compared to 25, 30% that it's going. So Bernie Sanders actually agrees with Trump there. Bernie Sanders also agrees with Trump to not uh, cut Social Security, uh, which is what supposedly the Republicans said, although there isn't really much proof as of recent uh, updates. So uh, let me play this video clip from Bernie Sanders. I think it ends very simply the way it should end in a democratic society. And that is the American people make the decisions. Do you really want to cut Social Security, Medicare and Medicaid several years after Republicans gave huge tax breaks to the richest people and the largest corporations, and at a time when we have more income and wealth inequality than we have had in 100 years. Really? Is that what you want to do? Is that what you think the American people want to do? And none other than our old friend Donald Trump, who I disagree with, needless to say, on everything. Trump told the Republicans, hey, you're crazy. You can't cut Social Security and Medicare. And I think they're going to listen to him. What are your thoughts on what Bernie Sanders had to say? Uh, I highly doubt that any uh, president politician would cut Social Security uh, benefits. I could see it being done, as I mentioned earlier, to the bureaucracy, the SSA, but not the benefits 
of individuals up to 70 million people. I highly doubt that'll happen. What are your thoughts on what Bernie Sanders had to say? Goodbye to social security taxes. Is Trump's proposal uh, uh, going to save you $1,500 to $4,000 a year? Is it possible? Uh, the possibility is yes. So Trump's proposal, game changer. The, the potential savings are significant. Depending on income and tax brackets, recipients could save between $1,500 and $4,000 annually. Uh, this could especially benefit middle income retirees who often bear the brunt of the current taxation system. So that is huge with Trump's plan, which obviously won't go into effect until he takes official office in January. This could be huge between $1,500 and $4,000 annually. You know, a lot of you say, all right, I'll believe it when I see it, when it's in my bank account. Well, we're going to see. Uh, let me know your thoughts. Do you believe in Trump? Not believe in Trump? Let me know down in the comments below. Let's go over more specifically what Trump is going to do. So six ways Trump could change your retirement from Social Security to Medicare. So let's get into it right here. Number one, lower taxes means more money to spend and save. So basically, I just went over that. Less taxes, money saved is money earned. It could be between $1,500 and $4,000 that you could see not added to your account, but saved. So that's where we're going to see the change there. Uh, number two, Social Security. Okay for now, but potential cuts in the future. Now, Trump vows to fight to protect Social Security, saying he will not cut a single penny and plans no changes to retirement age. This is the opposite of what his Republican Party members have said. Some of them have said that they wanted to potentially cut Social Security and uh, raise the retirement age, but Trump is actually going against his party, speaking for the people uh, what the people want when it comes to Social Security. So I highly doubt that Trump, that we'll see Social Security cuts under Trump. Number three, how slashing corporate taxes could lift your 401k. So Trump wants to lower corporate tax rate from 21% to 15%. If he's successful, the dollars that corporations avoid in taxes goes right to their bottom line, which boosts pro their profitability. And corporate earnings are a key driver of stock prices. So retirement savers who own stocks could see the value of their holdings in their 401k plans rise. Uh, so this will affect people who have 401ks, have money in the market, but most people at the bottom, most poor people who are struggling day to day with social secure with their with their finances, uh, who have the lowest social security payments, maybe you're one of them, uh, may not see this big increase to their social security. Just curious, do you have a 401k? Do you have money in the stock market? Uh, that's where this change is happening. Number four, tariffs could feed inflation hurting Americans' purchase power. So we've heard uh, Trump planning tariffs of up to 60% on China and 10 to 20% on other countries. Supposedly, these will be passed on to the consumer. Uh, so the cost of tariffs will be passed to the end consumer. So it ends up being somewhat of a sales tax. Now, I, I would be shocked if uh, these tariffs get into place and then everything gets really expensive and then inflation rises more. I, I just don't see that happening. Maybe it could happen and then maybe it gets reversed, uh, but that could be something that could be a negative effect, the tariffs. We're hearing, uh, I think, more negative effects of the tariffs than positive effects, but time will tell with that. Number five, healthcare costs could rise. So uh, we could see that healthcare is a big question mark. It's probably safe to assume that those costs will increase for most people who are retired when it comes to healthcare costs. And number six, deportation of undocumented immigrants could have negative effects. According to this article, it's saying many of the undocumented immigrants that Trump has threatened to deport earn and spend money in the economy and key sources of labor, agriculture, housing, and other services. One potential downside is the cost of fruits and vegetables could rise pinching the budgets of retirees and other Americans. What's more, it could result in even higher costs for new homes and home renovations if labor costs rise and the supply of workers shrink. So those are the changes that could happen 
under Trump. Let me know your thoughts on that. Uh, also, if you like how I shared with you the articles, the videos, showed you the sources, showed you the specific details backing up all these claims, hit the like button and subscribe to the channel for more important social security updates like this. And that is all the news that I have for you today to hopefully brighten your day a bit. Here's my daughter Bell's tip of the day. Hi guys, this is Bell, this is the tip of the day. And I am going to be telling you that you always need to have fun at the playground or at anything. You need to have fun with yourself and enjoy yourself how you are right now because the day after it won't be around so you have to enjoy the day first bye double payments for the month of november actually this week uh coming if you want to see who's getting this extra social security payment click this video right up here and i'll let you know exactly what's going on so click that video now and i'll give you and i'll see you in that video take care be safe thank you for watching